Hello, so now I'll show you how to use uh, pure ref for referencing. So you open up pure ref, it looks like this. And then uh, we can press right click and you see a bunch of uh, different settings here. Okay, so the very cool thing is always on top. So this window is always on top. And uh, now we can go ahead and press load. And we do a load images. Okay, load images, it will browse to our folder. And then you just load the two barrels that I've uh, researched before. And I'll open them. Scroll on my middle mouse click and I'll scroll in and out of this. Scroll out, scroll in. Okay, there's a green border at the side because uh, it's showing me that this is currently selected. So if I want to unselect it, I'll just click elsewhere. So left click on any of this, I can actually move this around and also make the canvas bigger. Okay, so very easy and for me to just place things around or create a mood board or something. Okay, if I want to enlarge this, this particular barrel, I can hold down control alternate and I can scale it up. Control alternate, I can scale it up. If I want to pan on my pure ref, I can hold down alternate and then I can pan on the pure ref canvas. So it's very important. Then uh, we'll be able to zoom out, pan to the corner, and then zoom in again, things like that. Okay, so as you can see, the borders are very big right now in the corner. So I can actually just mouse over this corner and I'll push it in. And from the top, I'll push the window down. Okay. And then I should kind of decide which barrel I really want to use. So I guess I'll use the one on the left. There we go. Like this. Okay. If you end up with a little bit of extra space, like it's not very clean, okay, we can just select this barrel. Okay. Very handy trick. Right click. Resize to selection. Control Shift R. So you just focus on this canvas here and it makes it super tight. And now it's always on top. So now if I'm sculpting in ZBrush, I'm using uh, number one brush, number two brush, number three brush. You know, my reference is still here, so I can just refer to it. And I can, best thing is I can zoom in. I can look at all the details. I can zoom out again. And I can zoom in and then I press Ctrl Shift R to rescale it. Okay, probably not a good idea. I should zoom out and press Ctrl Shift R. I can zoom in and look at the details and then zoom out again. No. So very handy for me to just keep this and uh, use Ctrl Shift R as necessary. Okay, customize. You'll be able to look at even more shortcuts over here. I won't go crazy and look at all these shortcuts or teach you everything but uh, there is some that is pretty interesting okay so you can also rotate the canvas i mean the images that you have and then uh, you can also pack and optimize all of them as well okay but you probably don't need to explore too much just deal with what i teach you for now you know uh, control alternate to just zoom in and zoom out an image and then uh, scroll to zoom in and zoom out alternate to pan and then control shift r to just crop this, uh, optimize this to selection and then place it neatly in our corner so that when we do a sculpting, we are comfortable looking at this reference. All right, so that's how you use uh, pure ref always on top of our ZBrush software for sculpting. All right, see you next time.